TV personality to her title after having accepted an offer to join the cast of the Best of STL as one of the hosts. Best of STL is now in its ninth season of live entertainment and compiling interviews and and hosts from all across from all across the St. Louis area. As spoken word artist, she has been opening act for national recording artists such as Common, Most Deaf, Anthony Hamilton, Tank, The Last Poets, and many more. Folks, she's been honored in just about every magazine you can find here in the St. Louis area. Area. So let's bring to the stage Miss Selena J. Find the microphone. There we go. Hey, how's everybody doing? Oh, come on, you can do better than that. You guys look so good. Clap like you feel good. No. You know what? I will come out there. I will take my shoes off and I will come out there and handle each and every one of you. You guys just don't know I'm from, from East Boogie. How's everybody feeling tonight? You can't have a good time? Oh, you got on white. Too cute. Okay, that's what it is. I understand. Thank you so much, Cedric, for the lovely introduction. I appreciate that. You all are with me tonight. Everybody awake. Everybody here. My name is Selena J from Magic 104.9. If you did not hear Cedric clearly, thank you all so much for coming tonight. You all look beautiful. There's nothing like a sea of just white. I absolutely love it. So, um, welcome to the second annual I'm a Survivor All White Benefit Party. We have an exciting evening in store for you tonight. We've got a couple of things that we're going to go through, but first I want to let you know the objective, exact, exactly why it is that we are all here tonight. First, we come to celebrate the survivors of disease and traumatic experiences. We also come to raise funds and support the American Cancer Society and their research efforts for the cure. We have come to provide a unique opportunity for celebrities, business professionals, and community leaders to network and give back. We also have come to bring entertainment, yay, and positive media attention to the metro area in the name of a meaningful cause, as well as educating the leaders in our community about the ways that you can reduce the chances of cancer and where to get support. So uh, I want to give you a snapshot of everything that we're going to uh, experience this evening. We have an exciting night in store for you. First, we've got performances by DJ Nooney. Give it up for DJ Nooney over here. On the ones and twos. Yeah. Uh, Corey Crypto over there as well. We've got also American Idol's Aloha Misha. She's going to debut her incredible new song, I'm a Survivor. We have a, a beautiful silent auction across the back of the room with some great items you're definitely going to want to take home tonight. So, also, if you have not seen, the photo booth is there in the back. The um, Smoothie King is over here giving up their, uh, their I'm a Survivor smoothies. Did everybody taste the I'm a Survivor smoothie? You're just shaking your head. People can't hear you when you shake your head. You guys, talk to me. Okay, let me, uh, let me, let me, let me explain something to you guys. I need a cordless mic, because I need to. Can I get a cordless mic for it? I'm serious. Okay, so this is how this thing works. See, I'm up here, and you guys are there, but we're interacting together, so I need to hear you, I need to feel you. You guys out there on what? I just need you to get a little bit more excited about tonight's event. Thank you. You guys so really want to know what these packages include? Yeah. Oh, that was so much better. One more time. Can you do it a little bit louder? You guys really want to know what these packages include? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. These are some really good packages. Seriously, we've got the MLB. We've got a lot of fellas in here. We've got the MLB All-Star Weekend package for two. That's good, right? Give it up if you like it. Y'all so whack. I'm just going to tell you right now. Okay, number two, we've got an NBA All-Star Weekend package for two. Isn't that exciting? Thank you. That was so great. Now, next, we have a Life and Luxury at Lola Dinner and Party package for eight. That's off the chain, right? Thank you, ladies. I appreciate that. We also have a custom live painting from legendary artist Tony Arts. So I'm excited about that. You all excited? You guys do not seem excited. What do we need to do? Do we need to have a dance off in the beginning of this? What, we need free drinks. Okay, so dance off. Give it up for dance off. We need to have a dance off. Okay, free drinks. We need to have free drinks. What about what about a fashion show? 
show. We need to have a fashion yeah. show. Would that get you excited? Well, you know we have a fashion show tonight. Are you guys excited about that? Did you know that? That there's going to be a fashion show tonight? You know what? It's, and it's featuring all of you. You all look so beautiful. So can I get some Rum Ray music real quick? Because I've got some fine fellas just standing right up here at the front. My dude sleep right here. Come on, can we get can we get some runway music? I'm serious. Like I know this was not a part of the program, but we need to wake y'all up. Come on, first of all, we've got this nice young brother. No, don't come to me. Walk the runway. Walk the run. Walk work it. Work it. Come on, give it up, ladies and gentlemen. He wasn't a part of the show. I made him a part of the show. Now sleep that you had it too easy because the music wasn't really playing. So I'm gonna need you to walk back through the situation. There's a lot of people that still fight this disease and my heart and my prayers go out to everybody that's affected by it. And I wrote this piece um, kind of kind of put myself in that position of what it would feel like if, if that was me. Lowest point I ever felt Played the cards that I was dealt And now I'm looking for your help because I can't do this by myself I leave my ego on the shelf No more holding on to pride, see I put it to the side because I need you in my life Make room for me and bless me till I feel I've had enough As my cup runneth over, knowing that it's never too much Just the hem of your garment if I can get a touch, knowing that your mercies will pour down and I'll drown in the rush. A blessing in the skies. They made it out alive. So many nights I cried, yet you stayed by my side, and I don't know how I survived. I shouldn't even be standing. Realizing how much of my life that I really took for granted. Words to God. I'm breaking bread inside of Bibles. And my arrival is a spiritual revival, survival. I thought the outcome would be hazardous. Met the Lord and I've never been to Nazareth, but he brought me back from the dead just like Lazarus. Blind to the sights, but I can see the sounds around me. A free spirit that was lost, but I'm glad the angels found me. Clinching to their wings, the things that I've seen can make cataracts lean. These sore eyes, Poor guys didn't know what hit them. Silent voices in my head screaming, just move. Safe havens and rescue missions. It's impossible to deny the work of God in the middle of a transitional storm. The traditional norm is jaded and faded by fools that created that old dances to the beast of different djembe and Congo masters. So our heads become slaves as our slaves become kings. After all of the field work is done, Rebuild your earth and run to the heavens. The children of the tribes that lost their land but kept their faith. Just take it to the altar with weary hearts and tired tongues. Sing praises until your lungs break down. Thanking him for every breath that you breathe. I leave it in God's arms and I fall back until spring comes back because I know it's a new day. And you still can't rush the sunrise so lift every voice and say let there be light. And weeping only endures the night so all we have is now just to smile a little longer. And what doesn't kill you, I swear to God, it makes you stronger. And what doesn't break you, it makes you who you are. So take it easy. And yes, I've never had cancer. So I'm not really sure. But I know how to all the medicines and everything else. Faith is the only cure. One more time, we can wrap the fans together. of the I'm a Survivor Foundation, Mr. Melvi Shahid is a dynamic leader who is coming to the stage to represent the 100 black men of Metropolitan St. Louis, the Prostate Cancer Association, and the Empowerment Network. If you do not put your hands together, I will come out there. First of all, y'all, 
Let's give it up to a great brother for putting on an event like this tonight. Let's give it up to Brother Lando. Yeah. Come on, y'all. Y'all can do better than that. Yeah. 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 Assalamu to each and every one of you. My name is Brother Melvin Shaheed, and I am a prostate cancer survivor, a prostate cancer advocate. And I'm also a very proud servant to cancer victims throughout the city of St. Louis, the founder and the CEO of the Empowerment Network for Prostate Cancer Survivors. I'm also the host of WGNU 920 AM, Closing the Gap on Prostate Cancer radio show, and a proud member of the 100 Black Men of Metropolitan St. Louis. Now, when you came in today, there was a table sitting downstairs. Each and every year for the last 10 years, the 100 black men have become a beacon of hope in the community for prostate cancer survivors and their families. So I want each one of you who have not registered for the 2010 Prostate Cancer Survivor Walk and Run to make, make your way down to the table. On that table there is information and there is educational material around cancer. Let me hit you with a few did you know. Did you know, hey brothers, brothers and sisters, let me get your attention. This is real up here, and this is real talk. One in four African American men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer in this lifetime. African American men have the highest rate of prostate cancer in the world. Two point times more likely to die from this disease. I was diagnosed with prostate cancer in March of 2007 and it was a very aggressive form of cancer. I was given two years to live. But five years later, I stand here tonight praising God and thanking Him for giving me a second chance and a new beginning. So let's go back to what Brother Cedric said. The slogan of the American Cancer Society is the slogan of the American Cancer Society is to celebrate Celebrate those who are fighting this disease. Remember the ones that we have lost from this disease and help us to continue to fight back to win the war against cancer in this lifetime. Now I would like to bring to you the executive director of the 100 Black Men of Metropolitan St. Louis. You all know him, Brother Jock Lane. All right. Standing strong for the 100 Black Men Empowerment Network and the community. I just want to thank Brother Orlando and I'm a survivor, the entire staff, organization, for allowing 100 Black Men of Metropolitan St. Louis to be a part of tonight's event. At the 100 Black Men, we're an international organization focusing on four core areas, which are mentoring, education, economic development, and health and wellness. As, as Mel shared with our Health and Wellness Initiative, it is the Prostate Cancer Survivors and Awareness Walk. And this year, we're celebrating 10 years of providing education and awareness to the community for prostate cancer. So if you not only are a prostate cancer survivor, but a survivor of cancer, period, while you know somebody that's a survivor, let me hear you with a round of applause. That's why we want to acknowledge all the survivors. So on behalf of the 100 black men, we've got our board president, Bill, we've got a couple of members surrounded throughout the room. We want to thank you for allowing us to be a part of this evening. Thank you. All right, John. Tonight we'll see about 20 of my new collection, 20 pieces. I hope you enjoy. You'll see some pieces from uh, New York Fashion Week of last year. So it should be fun and exciting. Again, it's an honor and a privilege. Thank you for including me. And uh, enjoy the show.
I did a fashion show with her a couple of months ago, and her work is just amazing. You guys need to see the half of what she's capable of. Thank you so much. One more time, put your hands together for all of us. Grab the mic. I thought they could hold the mic. Oh, he said no. Okay. So, so quickly, tell us a little bit about your story and what kind of cancer you had and how you overcame. Well, in 2008, uh, I was diagnosed with uh, testicular cancer, stage two, and uh, went through chemo and, and beat it uh, with God's help. Thank, thank the Lord for that. And uh, last summer, I was re-diagnosed again uh, with stage one, and again with, uh, with God's help, I beat it twice. So. Melvin Shaki, 20 seconds. I just want to thank Brother Alondo again for making this party a true purpose tonight. And I'm a prostate cancer survivor and a prostate cancer advocate and a proud servant. The cancer victim throughout the city of St. Louis. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm a cancer survivor. Ms. Olula, 20 seconds. Okay, um, I'm very private and personal, but they threw this at me at 29, a uh, few years back. I got diagnosed with thyroid cancer. It was papillary, and thank God I didn't have to go to chemo, but I did radiation, and I thank the Lord Jesus Christ for um, saving me, giving me an opportunity to reach out to others. You know, some people, when things happen to them, they think negative, but I think positive. I mean, the Lord has opened up so many opportunities for me to help and reach out to to others. So, thank you, Jesus. Thank you so much, all of us. Last but not least, Marguerite Gray, you want to share your story with us? <laughs> um, I was diagnosed in 97, I'm a three-time survivor. Did you say brain? Yes. So I want to thank my family, my boo, and the Lord, because I am truly, truly blessed today. Thank you so much for being here.
and just making sure that, that they get involved in positive things and positive outcomes. So we can't thank you enough on behalf of the city of St. Louis and my family and friends and people all throughout our community for the things that you continue to do on a daily basis. We prepared this resolution for you to commemorate this year's ball. And this resolution, although it's one of the piece of paper, it's the highest honor the board has to give. So what it will do, it will submit in time some of your many contributions on behalf of cancer survivors all throughout, not just the city, but throughout the nation. Because what you're doing here today is like a ripple effect. Because every family you help here today is going to pay it for it. They'll help other families and other people all throughout our communities. <laughs>
awesome, awesome. Guys, art is worth its weight in gold, I'm telling you. So, we'd like to start the bid off with this here today. And Orlando's going to help me spot, spot a few folks, so by a raise of hand, who would like to start the bid off today at $100? $100. Is your hand up, sir? Is your hand up? Don't itch up in here. Is your hand I'm talking to you. Is your hand up, sir? You started bid at $100? No, I was... Okay, your hand was broke. Okay, got it. All right. We right back. $100 for the painting today. You just watched it happen. We got it on photo. We got it on video. You're going to get all of that with the package. Can I start it out at $100 today for a piece of American art? Who's in for $100? Who's that? Is that Leon? Yeah. All right. $100. $100. Can I get $150? $150. Hundred dollars going once. Can I get one fifty? One fifty. You just gonna let Leon just walk out of here with it like that? Really? It's supposed to be a competition. You don't have to buy it. You can win it, right? So now it's time to win it. Can anybody give me one fifty? Give me one fifty for the painting here today. One fifty. One fifty. We're still at one hundred. One fifty. I'm gonna ask one more time. Who got one fifty? Where? Upstairs? I can't see nothing. This light is blinding. Right, somebody, somebody upstairs is going to give us 150 for it, alright? So it's 150, can I get 200? Leon, we back to you. 150 at 200. 200? 150, 200? Go on, boys. Who said 200? Raise your hand, be loud and proud. Who is that over there? Alright, so we at 200. 200, can I get 250? 250, we back on the balcony. 250? 200, we got 250, we're gonna go again. 200 going once, 200 going twice, last chance, 200, sold in the back. Who are you, girl? Come on over here, we need to see you. I can, we can't see it, I mean, for real, I can't see nothing, nothing. Right, it is blind in. Is, is this what it's like to be a performer? Wow. I was just an athlete, I'm sorry. Okay. 200 bucks. Who's our winner? Come on up here. 200 bucks. Don't be shy. Come on up here. Where are you at? We can't see. You got to raise your hand, put up a, hold up your cell phone, something. All right. Who's my cashier? <laughs> All right, I'll say it. Folks, we're gonna have uh, uh, someone uh, take that check, cash, or money order, or blood from you, credit card. Okay, I'll stand. Say what? If you can, uh, follow, you can follow Tony here real quick. We'll go ahead and get that paid for down there for cash here. Thank you so much. All right, here's the next iPhone for me. Has anybody ever been to Lola before? You ever been to Lola? You know, that's a happy spot. Don't act like you've never been to Lola. Has anybody here ever been to Lola downtown on Washington? Act like you did. Has anybody been to Lola that had fun in Lola? Yeah! Yeah, exactly. Every Friday night, I mean, you know how to do it. Chris Hansen over there, hey, that's a great spot. I bring all my out-of-towners there. It's a great place to be. So, Orlando, what should we start this bid off at? This is the, uh, this is the Life at Lola. Life at Lola for eight. This package includes, you ready for this? A gourmet chef is going to perform, uh, is going to perform a four-course meal for you. It does also include premium bottle service for you, exquisite dessert, free tickets to get in, and valet parking is taken care of. Yes, at Lola, for eight, party of eight, and you can kick it to the wheels fall off in there. You got personal seating, four course meal, premium bottle service, free valet, includes a lot of stuff. So, can we start the bid off here at $200? $200, night at Lola, four course meal for eight. For eight. So how much would that really be in real life if you just, if you just, if Applebee's and you calculate, come on, do the math, you know that's an incredible deal. Who can give me $200 for it right now? $200, we're not moving on until I get some money, that's it. So we are pushing there, we ain't moving on, we ain't moving on. I'm big, I'm strong, I ain't moving, okay? $200 for the Lola package. Who give me $200? Okay, who give me $100 for it? Who give me $100? Who give me $100? Who give me 
Man, you gotta raise your cell phone or something. I can't see it. Can we turn these lights off just the one down here at the bottom so I can see? You give me a hundred? Okay, who give me two hundred for it? That's a hundred going once. Who give me two hundred for this pack? Huh? Who we say one fifty? One fifty? Okay, who give me two hundred? Will you give me two hundred? Two hundred? Speak up, brother. I can't hear you. 200? We're back to 150. Who give me 200? 200. I said I ain't moving until I get some money, so y'all just gonna have to wait it out. This is for the this is for the good of the cause right here. I can't sell it for 150. Can't sell it for 150. If you give me 250 for it right now, I'll close the bid. Who give me 250 for it right now? For eight, four course meal, premium bottle service included, free valet. Free entry into Lola and your own private section for the evening. That is a great way to round it down some folks. I don't know about you, but I spent 200 on dinner for my girlfriend. And let them know that this money is not going to Lola. No, it isn't. Oh, I'm sorry. I, that is such a great point, Selena. You know, that's what I'm here for. Lola has done an outstanding job. Number one, the reason that we even have these beverages in here today is a function of a partnership between Crown Royal and Lola. So get those guys a round of applause. That's the reason that they got it looking sexy up in here. And then number two, out of the goodness of their heart, he said, Cedric, how big of an auction item do you need? I asked him for what we wanted and he gave it to us. So 100% of the proceeds go toward the benefit of the foundation. So let's bring it back. You give me 250. You give me 200. That's my man. And he got a cell phone up. That's what's up. All right, who give me 250? 250 for the package at Lola for eight. Who give me 250? 250, 250, 250. 200 going once. Anybody give me 250? 200 going twice. Anybody give me 250? 250 right there? All right, we're up to 250 now. Oh, you finally woke up. The competition came. The girl next to you. That's what happened. Okay. Who give me 300? 300 for the logo package. We're going to make it quick. 250 going once. One, two. 250 going twice. Anybody give me 300? So for 250 right there, bought the logo package. Give him a hand. Serving you up. Come over here to the side of the stage for me, please, because I can't see you at all. You can bust my head in the dark. I wouldn't know who it was. And just a brief announcement, the silent auction is closed. If you would like to, if you made a bid, go back to the back table to see if you're bid one for the silent auction. All right. So, last two packages, and you don't have to see me the rest of the night. Now, I said that I went across the country, I've traveled quite a bit, I've done a lot with athletes and entertainers and what have you, there's some cool experiences out there. And here's a couple of them I think you may really want to partake in. In uh, the MLB All-Star Weekend, who's a baseball fan out there? MLB All-Star Weekend, okay, we'll flip it then. We'll flip it, it's okay, baseball not your thing. How about basketball? Yeah? Everybody rooting for LeBron? No? no? Oh, okay, see? Okay, see? You know, whatever your flavor is, I got something for you. How about being able to go to Houston, Texas next year for the All-Star Weekend? Whoa! So here's the package. This is what it includes. Three nights. That's three nights deluxe hotel accommodations at the Woodlands Waterway Marriott Hotel Convention Center. That's three nights, by the way. That's from February 15th to February 18th. Also includes tickets to the Rookie Game and Challenge on Friday night. That's for two. Also includes tickets to the All-Star Saturday night events. There's about three events that night that are very, very high end. All the athletes come and hang out. Also, tickets to the All-Star Game on Saturday night. Tickets to the dunk contest and three-point contest as well. It includes a rental car for you to get around all three days while you're there. It includes a deluxe gift bag that's worth about $600 each gift bag. It includes daily breakfast for you and you get your own personal concierge to help you arrange all your travel, all your arrangement at the end of the day. And here's the killer. It includes, it includes all taxes and all gratuity pay. That's it. You buy this package, all you got to do is get there and everything else is taken care of. It's a beautiful thing.
So, I need at least $3,500 for this one. Who started to pay that $3,500? $3,500 for the NBA weekend. Basketball match, okay? Thirty-five hundred. Okay, who give me a thousand? Who give me a thousand for this package? Okay, I can't sell it.
Put your hands together, together, together. Oh, listen. It was love. Metropolis, Ethno Entertainment, uh, Ethno Music Group. <laughs> I am so I am a survivor. I'm a survivor. Cancer benefit badge. The lovely ladies. Photos by Bob. Oh, yeah. One time for all the women I am proud of. Two times for all my survivors. The problems of the world I know you're tired of. Don't cry, baby. Renzo's here. Dry them eyes up. R.I.P. Mama died back in 22 Ain't nothing like when they cast me right in front of you Had your boy sicker than the summer flu Devil had me thinking like God never loved me Fool, then Mr. President, the people need some answers A cure for AIDS, leukemia, cancer My daughter say she wanna be Rihanna 
And who are you to go messing her plans up? If you proud to be alive, baby, stand up. If you proud to be black, put your hands up. Yeah, I've been to jail and would do the crime, do the time. At least I manned up. Sing to him, Paul. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs>